everyone so welcome to another collaboration and this collaboration is actually what is in my Easter basket I am hosting this collaboration and I want to thank everyone that participated in this collaboration from the we love collab group on Facebook and the playlist link will be down in the description box down below so check that link after this video to watch everyone else that participated and see what they put in their Easter basket what ideas if you're stuck on what to put in your Easter basket it's always great and I love watching those kind of videos because there's times where I'm stuck on what to put in a Easter baskets or what to get for Easter things like that so definitely check that playlist down below and I hope you guys like this video so let's get started so for the first thing is I like when it comes to Easter, I like to shop bargained wise. Um, the kids, they outgrow things. There's times when it comes to Easter, they may not always want to have that item um, just because of it may be an Easter theme and they end up outgrowing it. Especially like my oldest son, when it's Easter, he wants that item. He'll have it for a, like about a month, two months. And then when the next holiday comes, it ends up sitting on the shelf. So I just try to, one, get a lot of bargained deals and try to go as cheap as possible. And two is get items that they are going to want more or items that they are going to need and um, use throughout the summer especially. So first thing is the Easter baskets. This time I actually got Easter baskets. Sorry, today was a windy day. And I'm just trying to pretty much rock the mom bun. But anyways, that. Um, this time I actually got some Easter baskets, but I thought they were really cute because it's not identifying it being Easter. So I thought this was cute because then they could go ahead and put their items in it. And then it's easy to actually go ahead and put inside of those cubbies that's actually small enough to put it in the cubbies. So I got blue, green, and then I also got purple. I thought they were really cute. It's see-through as well and it has like the image of kind of like an Easter basket but it doesn't say like Happy Easter or anything on it so you can use it pretty much for anything and that's what I was loving about this especially when it comes into the car I thought this was gonna be a great idea like when we're on road trips um, being able to put their items inside of it and then be being able to have that item or the items that they want for a road trip in it so I thought this was a great idea it was 88 cents at Walmart um, and I could use it for multiple purposes that's what I like about doing um, buying stuff like for Easter when it comes to Easter buying things that they could use multiple purposes for um, like last year and the last year before that I bought them shovel and a bucket like the summer shovel in a bucket and then put their Easter stuff inside of it because then they can use it for summer as well. The next thing is, is these plastic eggs. These ones are a little bit bigger, so they're about that big. Um, about three inches or so. Uh, yeah, it doesn't say. But it's $1.98 for this. It was at Walmart. I love the colors on it. There's light purple, yellow, light green, light blue, and then orange. So I like that. Oh, and pink <laughs> all the way at the top. So that's what I like about these ones. I like using the little bit bigger ones so I could put like little tiny toys inside of it or um, change or multiple, like different kind of candy. Different kind of candy because usually the smaller ones don't have the room to put a lot of candy, especially like those. Um, when you get in a pack, those uh, candy bars, they don't always fit in the smaller ones. So this one I like using because then you can put change and a candy inside of it. So that's what I like about these ones here. And then plus we dye eggs and stuff like that. So I went to two stores, by the way. I'm going to try to do all the Walmart ones first. And the next store I went to was also um, Dollar Tree. I'm like trying to remember. I thought these were cute. My kids love the glasses and they like anything that has like a character on it and being able to like wear it as a mask. So these here are bunny masks. I thought that was super cute and they're actually 98 cents and they come in a pack of three. So you get a pink one, a white one, and a blue one. And that's perfect for me since I have three children. 
that's what also I like to do is getting items where it's three and one kind of deal when you have like multiple children and for me I have three children so this one here are these little cars I decided to get all of the same kind um, these ones I believe were three dollars though inside of Walmart um, I thought they were super cute my kids all three of them like cars especially my daughter she loves cars so this is just one of those Fisher Price little rooming room room cars <laughs> I can't remember uh, little people's Fisher Price the little cars so that's what they are pretty simple and then lollipops my daughter was with me when I went shopping so <laughs> there was lollipops and then I got play-doh since my kids love play-doh they each get a little play-doh so there's a blue one a pink one and a green one like I said if I could get the three in one deal I go for it but when it doesn't come to those things it's better to just get um, cheaper priced ones now here's this one where they're gonna get actually two of them each since there is three I'm able to split it into three they're little uh, marshmallows I believe yes marshmallow bunnies And then, yes, I'm the mom that goes ahead and, like, gets the sweet stuff as well when it comes to their Easter basket. But that's just me. Um, then there's these ones. They're milk chocolate, cocoa butter, milk chocolate. So milk chocolate and cocoa butter. That's what these ones are. And they're the little chocolate bunnies. I thought they were super cute. They were actually a dollar. And then these were also a dollar. I thought they were so cute. Like, you cannot really find something that looks like this. So you got the candy, the swirl candy. And then you get a cute little marshmallow uh, character on top. So this one has a little chicken um, with inside of an egg, cracked egg. That one is pink and purple. And this is a dollar, so I was surprised because usually you can't find those. And then the swirl one with a cute little bunny in it. And then there's this one with the white bunny with an egg and it's green. So if you don't get the color scheme I'm kind of going for, so my daughter loves purple, purple and pink. And then my youngest son likes green and red. And my oldest son loves blue. So that's kind of how I go by it. When I can find that, I can go by it like that. Okay, so the next thing I have here is now from the dollar store. So first thing also is around Easter time, we love doing bubbles so the kids stay outside and play with the bubbles. And I love the three pack as well. So I actually got a few more of these so then I could also use them when summer comes. And it's going to be like fun for the kids for summer. So again, the red and the blue and the green. So green for my youngest, red for my daughter, and blue for my oldest. And then we also have the last items. And this is just little stuff that I put inside of their Easter baskets. And it's not including like what they get from grandma or anything like that. Like my mom loves to send them items. Okay, she'll send them items, and um, she likes to get them little things as well. So, we actually got different, multiple different books, so I do have to probably get another one for my oldest son. Um, but yeah, so these are all from the dollar store. I love the dollar store because look at this. A dollar for these books. Oops, that one's upside down. So a dollar for those books, that's what I love. So I have these two here, which is also for my daughter and my son, my youngest son. So there's Dory, they love Dory. Okay, so then we have this one, which is First Step Into Faith. Um, it's a Bible book. I love these, especially over there at the dollar store, which they didn't have many this time, which I was kind of surprised, but then again, I wasn't too surprised, especially since around here. 
the small dollar tree bible books are always a grab still especially around this time but i got this one and i thought it was super cute this one will actually be for my oldest because it has oh if you could see it has more words in it so he'll be able to read that since he's reading and then this one here is for my youngest son it's pony wants to play and it doesn't have as many words like that one's more of a one two paragraph each page this one is just little words here at the bottom so this one's actually perfect for my youngest son and then I also got this one for my youngest son and it's the uh, what is it inside out can't so I thought that was really cute as well so there's those ones and then this one is also for my youngest son which is letters and alphabet since he is learning to like write all his letters and his alphabets and stuff like that that is what they're at right now is learning how to write them so it goes like that and then writing them at the bottom and then these are for my oldest son so there's the reading book here there's this one I thought it was really cute and it has addition and subtraction so I thought that was really good especially like this this is cute so he has to um, add this up put the number and then connect the dots that was actually pretty cute that was actually pretty clever too so to be able to connect the dots he has to do the math first and then the subtraction part and I thought that was really cute as well and that is actually it for my haul what's in my Easter basket kind of thing for my children. So I got, hope you guys like this uh, collaboration. Again, don't forget the, hmm, the playlist is down below. And uh, don't forget to check that out for everyone that participated in this collaboration. And I want to thank everyone that did participate in the collaboration from the We Love Collab group on Facebook. And I'll see you guys to the next collab. Bye.